How's it going? Curtis Gore here and today I'm going to teach you how to upload a video to YouTube. Now I'm assuming you already have a YouTube account. Uh, they're free. Um, they're real easy to set up. If you don't have an account up here where it has, uh, there will actually be a sign up link um, somewhere up here in the upper right hand. But um, This is kind of like the home page. Once you log into the account you'll come up here. It has your subscriptions and recommended videos and whatnot. But uh, the last video I showed you how to actually edit raw footage using Windows Movie Maker. So once you have the video edited, this is the steps you would go through to actually get it up on to YouTube. Um, like I said, once you log into your account, this will kind of be your little home page. And there's this upload button in the upper right hand corner here. We're going to go ahead and click on upload. That's going to bring us to the file or video file upload screen. Um, down here where it says select a video to upload, all you got to do is click on browse and that will pop up. Um, you know your your the areas on your computer. Like I said, I usually try to keep what I'm working on on my desktop just to make it easier to find. And how to video is the one we made last time. All right, so once you selected that, just go ahead and click upload. And now it's going to bring you to kind of like this little information screen here. Now what's important about this is uh, when you're doing marketing, which typically uh, um, you know, say for example, you're trying to drive drive traffic to a particular program or to a particular website. Um, you want to load uh, your title with keywords, which again would be whatever you're searching for. For example, this particular how-to video, um, I'm marketing CurtisGore.com, which is my personal blog. In the video, so you would want to make sure that uh, you put. what you're actually marketing which like I said would be CurtisGore.com I'm just going to put now has training videos like I said this is CurtisGore.com is going to be my keyword so you want it to appear in your your actual title um, same thing with the description here now when you get down to the description the very first thing you want to do again because we're trying to drive traffic to a website uh, people are lazy for lack of a better term they don't want to have to go up to the the search bar and actually type in a web address so what I recommend is whatever you're promoting whatever address you're trying to send people to whatever program whatever right off the bat go ahead and put and you want to make sure you, you type in the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash because what that does is that's going to make that clickable um, and I'll show you that here in a minute when we get done now depending on who you talk to in the description box here, they'll tell you different things, and I've I've done it a couple different ways, and um, I, I honestly can't say for sure which way it happens to work better. But the description box is one of the things that Google and these other search engines will actually look through uh, for content as they're indexing your video pages. So again, if CurtisGore.com is the keyword you want to use, general rule of thumb is early and often. Uh, so you want to um, again, start out with CurtisGore.com. I'm just going to type some stuff in here. Like I said, I'm I'm just going to kind of put some arbitrary stuff in here because uh, uh, this is all just demonstration purposes. But again, you want to you want to put a clickable link first thing right up right up front. And then, um, like I said, you want to write this almost like it was a blog, or if you're writing, uh, you know, kind of like a press release or an article. In that, whatever your keyword is, you want to you want to make sure it appears early in the copy and often in the copy. So, all right, once we get a little bit of content in there, what I usually do down at the end is come and just kind of keyword load it. We'll go Curtis Gore. Curtis. Com. Who is Chris? See, basically, all I'm doing is just loading um, various things down here. And something else you can do here is, is say, for example, you're targeting like my blogs about internet marketing. So I would put maybe internet marketing down here, online marketing. Uh, you know. Network 
marketing, um, making money online, you know, et cetera, et cetera. So again, you kind of want to you you always want to start out with a a keyword loaded title. Um, many times people call this a long tail keyword. Uh, you want to start in the description box. The very first thing you want to do is put in a clickable link to whatever website you're trying to drive the traffic to. Uh, and again, how you do that is you want to make sure you have the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash in front of whatever the domain name happens to be. Uh, and then again, uh, treat this box very similar to a blog or any other kind of uh, content that you're trying to get indexed by the search engines. Uh, and you want to keyword, keyword load it. Uh, try to have your keyword near the beginning of your sentences, near the, the beginning of your copy. And then usually once I put a little bit of content, which again this is just real basic and generic here, uh, I'll throw in just some targeted keywords here. Um, you know, let's throw MLM in there also. Now tags, tags are a little bit more specific type uh, keywords. This is what, um, like when you go to Yuhu, or I'm sorry, YouTube up here, and you type in uh, something in particular, like say you you type in home-based business, uh, it's going to go to the tags first. So, like I said, let's just say it's a home-based business, and these are keyword or comma separated. So, if you have multiple uh, words in your keyword phrase, just type it out and then leave a comma. We're going to do internet marketing. And I'm going to put Curtis Gore in here again. This is a how-to video. So basically you just want to use, like I said, relevant keywords in here. Uh, you know, if you were targeting uh, real estate agents or uh, mortgage brokers or anything like that, you may want to go ahead and type down here real estate and so forth. And under category, um, this this may vary depending on uh, what you happen to be doing. Um, if you're just doing some kind of a, uh, you know, just a, a blurb about, you know, who you are, an uh, introduction or something, you might want to put it under people and blogs. This happens to be a how to video, so I'm going to put it under how to and style. And Again, the whole purpose is driving traffic to my website, so of course I want to make it public, share it with the world. And once you get all this information here entered in, all you got to do is click on Save Changes. Now, if it's a very large video, uh, this will continue to upload even after you get through typing in all your uh, details on your video. This was a very, very short video. Like I said before, it was only maybe 17 or 18 seconds long, so it uploaded pretty quick. Um, once this says success and success, it's all, it's you're done here. Um, so you can go to up here to your name, my videos, and here you'll see the video that I just uploaded there. So now I'm, I'm going to click on it. Go ahead and pause this so you can see what I'm talking about here. Now, if you'll see here, up in the info box here, right off the bat, here's a clickable link. And if somebody clicks on that, it's going to take them to my blog. So, like I said, whatever website you're trying to drive traffic to, you want to make sure you put a clickable link in here. Now, if we click on more info here, it's going to lay out everything I actually typed in here. You can see again, uh, you know, just my basic arbitrary content here, but it starts out with CurtisGore.com, CurtisGore.com, uh, CurtisGore, CurtisGore.com, who is Curtis Gore? Again, Curtis Gore being our keyword, it's it's in the title, it's in the address, it's at the beginning of my copy, it's early and often in the copy, here it is again, and again, and again. And that's the idea, is when, when the search engines come through and they're, they're filtering through this trying to figure out what this page happens to be about what what this the content on this page is they're going to see Curtis Gore popping up everywhere so chances are when somebody goes to the search engine and types in Curtis Gore I've got a much much higher chance of this video uh, ranking or or getting organic search results meaning showing up on on the free parts of Google 
uh, based on that keyword. And again, whatever program you happen to be promoting, you know, if this is, uh, you know, whatever, um, you just want to make sure you put that clickable link in there so that people can write off your video as soon as they get done watching while they're watching or whatever. All I got to do is click here. It takes them where you want to go, and uh, that's just one one way of of getting your videos online and helping to drive free traffic to your website. Again, this is Curtis Gore, and I appreciate you guys watching.